2008, the last time a metro school beat a suburban school. In fact, it's been 17 years since Roosevelt was victorious against a suburban school. Warriors, though, get on the board first. Max Bartacek, 32-yard field goal right down the middle. Makes it three-zip Waukee. Riders, though, answer in the second. Jamison Patton hits George Williams. Back of the end zone, 11-yard strike. Roosevelt leads 7-3. Next walk, key possession, Blake Houck looking downfield, launching, but there's Patton, the quarterback, also playing safety to intercept it. Iowa State has already offered Jamison a scholarship as a safety. Riders in business. A few plays later, Patton scrambling, looking, end zone, finds Lucas Pullman. 10-yard touchdown, 13-3 Rough Riders at the half. More from Jamison Patton in the third quarter. This time, keeps it himself. Right side, airborne, over the goal line. That's in for a touchdown. Roosevelt extends the lead 19-3. Defense shuts it down after that. Colin Murphy in the backfield for the sack. Some help from Cole Norris. Let the celebration begin. The streak is over. Roosevelt knocks off a suburban school 19-3 over Waukee. Here's Keith Murphy. So the streak ends here at Waukee Stadium. Des Moines Roosevelt defeats Waukee and ends that long losing streak of Des Moines Public Schools against the suburbs. It had been 128 straight. And Jamison Patton, how does it feel to have that out of the way? I'm lost the words right now. There's no other feeling like it. I'm just blessed to be here with my team, blessed to be in the situation and bust to get that done. You made some plays tonight. You had a couple of touchdown passes, a touchdown run. You had an interception. Uh, what was it like out there? What were you trying to do and how did you do it? I'm just trying to go out there, have fun with my brothers. That's all it is. What was the focus going into this game? Now that it's over, how much can you tell us about the streak? How much was it talked about? How much motivation did it provide? Coach started off the slide with this week, 128 games, we straight losses. And I, this morning I posted on my Twitter, 2004 is the last time we won a game against the suburbs, and it happened. Well, congratulations. That's quite a performance tonight. Thank you, sir. You're a playmaker. Jamison Patton, playmaker. His teammates call him J-Mo. J-Mo made some plays tonight. Roosevelt moves to 2-0 and zero on the season, knocks off Waukee here at Waukee Stadium, joined by the head coach of the Riders, Jared Barnett. Coach, what does it mean to not hear, have to hear about this streak anymore? <laughs> it feels great. Um, it's, it's, it feels great, and it's going to feel great. But, um, you know, first of all, I got to give I got to get hats off to our guys. Um, they came out and they just fought and fought and fought um, and they did a great job. And I mean, we told them before the game, you know, the streak is what it is. Um, but regardless, at the end of this game, we got to come out to a no. Um, and we got to be successful and we got to execute and we got to do our job and, and our, our guys came out and did it. But I told these guys that, you know, the, the breaking the streak starts now, but this is just the beginning. You know, we've, we have a long season ahead of us. We got to make sure that we continue to be successful and continue to go after these, you know, go after all these teams. And uh, we, I mean, we want to win football games and, and that's what our team is focused on. Jared Barnett, congratulations. Thank you, sir. Jared Barnett, head coach of the Roosevelt Rough Riders. Winners tonight, still undefeated on the season.